Hello and welcome back. I'm b Joe and this is a tutorial for Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. Today, ships. You can find ships if you go to infrastructure and click the ships button that um, looks like this. And then you have a bunch of different buildings that you can go. Cargo harbor, small medium, uh, aggregate loading harbor, a pumping harbor, a harbor for containers and vehicles, passengers. All of these, and then you have a ship dock, and a ship dock medium, and um, a dry dock. Dry dock is where you build your ships by yourself. A ship dock is where you can buy your ships. And the size of the ship dock does matter. You cannot buy a large ship at a small dock. So we got that built, and then I will just use one of the harbors. The harbors are very similar and self-explanatory. Pumping harbor is just for fuel, or for uh, fuel, bitumen, and oil. A aggregate loader is for all the aggregates that we have in the game, and then a container is for all the containers that we have in the game. Pretty straightforward. Let's place a medium harbor. All these buildings are relatively large, so give it some time. And to place them, you need to m mess with them a little bit to get them close to between water and land. But once it's green, just build it, and we'll get it done. These... Um, the dock does not need power. All you do here is buy ships. And then you just click on your buttons as you usually do. Um, select whatever ship you want. I want the biggest ship we can get. Great. Um, and you can buy more. There's up to three spots here, pretty obvious. The ships themselves, while the harbor is um, loading, have a very similar setup as other vehicles in the game. The only thing that's different is they have a new stop on the red star, which is the USSR, and the blue star, which is the Western countries. Um, so when you, for example, want to import something, you click these first. If you don't, then you click on last. So select a new stop, click on whatever harbor you have, tell them what they're supposed to do, load or unload, doesn't really matter. I'm gonna say unload, and then we have the NATO border closer on our side here. So we'll tell it, hey, this is your new stop. Tell the ship to go, and in this case, we'll just run to the NATO country first and load whatever we can there. And there we go. The ship will just load whatever it wants to load. And once it's full, it will come back to the border, to the harbor that you um, started from, and we'll unload whatever you have there. Um, there's a couple more things with ships. You can place these buoys, they're like waypoints, and use them like waypoints, and different harbor types that we already talked about. I hope you guys learned something today. Um, if you did, like and subscribe. If you didn't, let me know what else you want me to cover, and I'll see you again next time. Bye!